All right, welcome to Should You Buy About a 20 Year Old Snowmobile. This guy here is uh, 05, not quite 20 years old, but most of the sleds that will be in the same price range are gonna be about 20 years old. And we're gonna discuss if it's worth it to uh, blow a couple thousand bucks or whatever on an old sled if it's worth it. There's just a lot of, you know, kind of stuff that you're gonna have to think you're gonna have to deal with, with like weak plastic parts because of the sun, rip seat, the, every piece of rubber you could imagine falls apart. Like I had to get this replaced, but let's shut up and ride it. Uh, look at the track on this guy. There's no, this is a freaking worn out trail track. Now the only thing really that sucks is you're gonna wanna buy one of these sleds, an older sled for about three grand or so. And you're gonna go, well I can fix it up, put a track on it, put a can on it, some aftermarket goodies, shocks, etc, etc. But then if you get thinking, you kind of lose motivation because you're like, well, I could just sell the sled, save up the money for those parts and get a kick-ass sled that's a lot newer. But if you really just love whatever sled you are, you have some sort of attachment to it, then I guess, sure, go ahead, go dump a bunch of money into it. But for me, this isn't even my sled, this is my dad's sled. He left it abandoned, basically, and I fixed it, and he's letting me riding it. Only trouble is he wants it back now. So I gotta buy my own snowmobile. Yeah, it's just like 
sleds are cheaper than what people want for, for this sled today. But, you know, the whole COVID crap. by a really 
good one. But I'm gonna give you a little bit of advice. If you're a skeeter guy, that's my expertise. The revs, the 600s are awesome, reliable machines. The 800s, I don't care what year, any rev that's an 800 is basically garbage. They can be good for a bit, but they're, they're not great. Same thing with the p tex they're pretty bad. If you're gonna buy a 800, just get that e tech You'll hear that everywhere. The e tech I rode, oh my god, so crazy.
to go to the mountains, this is this is probably not as fun, but it's still pretty good. Have I ever been to the mountains? No. Um, my best friend does not no. he always is like I want to buy a snowmobile I want to buy this I want to buy that because you know I got dirt bike sleds and he always wants to go riding with me and he will not commit to it he spends all his money on stupid video games and booze and vapes and all like this stupid materialistic items that are just what's the point of them I'm a, I'm a die hard like engine guy and I literally I, I mean I don't take care of myself the best but I, I take care of my machines but point is if you want something commit to it and you will get it believe it in your head that you are gonna get a snowmobile or whatever and you'll get it you just gotta stay strict to yourself don't disrespect to your disrespect yourself and lie to yourself just commit to it and get that fucking snowmobile stop going out and partying every weekend instead spend that money on a sled way healthier for you'll be way happier but it's pretty easy for me to say because I don't drink.
I think I'm gonna end it here and start recording another video. Um, if you made it to the end, I highly doubt anybody did, so... Yeah, I think I'm talking to nobody right now, but uh, thanks for watching. Um, subscribe, like if you want to, I guess. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna start recording another video. Peace out.